you ain't running no drag six, are you? Oh, come on, bro. Welcome back to Car Gamer, everybody, and we are on Forza Horizon 2 tonight. It's been a little while since I played the game, especially on the channel. Uh, just been kind of busy playing Dirt Rally. You know, I'm addicted to that game, especially Pike's Peak. People are like, Pike's Peak is impossible. I'm like, no, I am addicted to it. I only posted one video up on that. Oh, going to hit this bench. Get out of the way. Oh. Screwed my headlight up and grill and everything. Ah, oh, some bitch. Anyways, we're rocking the old 53 Ford. Well, that's what I used to have. It's almost the same color as this, but really faded and really rat rotted. But my parents made me sell it when I went to college. They were like, you got too many cars. But anyways, getting into this video, we are going to probably end up doing a garage build. I have something in mind, so I'd probably rather not do a wheel spin build today. Drop this thing in a second. Watch this. Oh yeah, that thing is a beast. But, let's get in the garage. Alright dude, let me know what you need. Well alright folks, we're actually going to build something kind of nostalgic today. I have been saving this for a long time. You're probably thinking, not that, Joe. You ain't going to drift that. Nope. We're going to drift the 57 Bel Air. Now, I want to do a total custom paint job on this, but I probably won't do it this video. So you guys will probably see it in the next video in the future. But let's get in this shit. All right, folks. We are done building the car. Ended up being pretty you know legit I mean it's got a pretty good overall standing all the way around handling acceleration speed launch braking blah 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 anyway we're rocking 832 horsepower 741 foot-pounds of torque weighing in less than 3,000 pounds with this big old beast yeah your uh, modern cars don't even amount. I mean, they're like almost 2,000 pounds more than that. And the weight ratio is more in the front. So displacement 7,000, you know. Now looking at this beauty, she is a beauty. I mean, she's got a nice rake, the old school look to it. Dropped it all the way in the front, raised it all the way in the rear. definitely got some power. I adjusted the gears. I did some adjustments. So the thing is, oh, don't, don't scratch Joe. She's a classic. Oh yeah, that gear adjustment is definitely going to do the work. Beautiful. Alright, where are we going to? We might not go to the docks today. Might change it up. I'd love to go up there on those dirt roads, but I don't think we're allowed to. I ain't going to hurt the car trying to get the up there. The leader of your party is starting a race. Press X to... So, where do we want to go today? 
Change it up a little bit, huh? Okay, folks, we are at least at a good spot to do some drifting. And we're going to see what this old girl is going to do. Right now, she's going to get a little sideways the like that. party is starting a race. Press X to join them. It's going to take me a second to learn about this heavyweight. This is a heavyweight. We need to start doing some uh, heavyweight competitions, too. Nothing but American big old steel out there. Ripping it sideways. Nice big circles, but that's not what we're going for. Not sure what this place is about. Never really played around too much out here. See if we can throw a nice little oh. Oh yeah, go through here. Uh oh. You guys hear that? You guys know what that is. That's the most evil thing I know called rain. <gasps> oh no! I scratched my car! Uh, I did more than scratch it, I dented it. I feel sorry for myself. Anyway, I know this thing can get it, so just gotta learn these areas around here. Especially with the rain coming now. Oh, we're spinning it out. Maybe go in here. Oh, another spin out. Oh. It's definitely a big boat. She might take a little more adjustments. Not bad for a first build, I don't think. Or first drive with the build, I mean. Oh yeah. What we can do? Oh, come on, girl! I know you can get it a little more sideways than this. I blame Dirt Rally. Been playing that game way, way, way too much. Everybody's like, "Dude, you need to play this with me." And I'm sorry if I haven't got to play as many games with y'all as I want to but sometimes I get busy I do work and you know summer's arising so I don't think I'm going to get to work on my car this this weekend because I hear snow's upon us it's definitely raining right now but it's only rain oh we are just spinning this thing Good thing we're taking this out in the open right now. I mean, to be honest, I don't know if I could do anything really crazy with this right yet. The leader of your party uh -oh. is starting a race. Press Whoa. X to join them. We gotta hit that sign. We got it. Just nicked it, but we got it. Thing's got some massive gears in it. Oh, barely squeezed underneath that. I was like, am I gonna be able to make it underneath that thing? Got a dent in the front end, mate. Still not bad though. I mean, it's definitely doing its job. Get into the fifth gear here. Oh my. Oh me, oh my. Is there 
they're way in between. Nope, nope, they're in way in between those. Thing's definitely a beast. You guys are probably wondering, why'd you build a drag car into a drift car? Well, it's still over a drive. I just put bigger tires on the front end. See? You can do a lot with an old muscle car. Or old American cars. Or trucks. You know what you're doing. Me, I graduated from Wildtech. And... I'm obsessed with American Muscle, have been since I was born, and always will be, until I die. Oh shit, oh, not the tail light, bent the fender, quarter pound, my bad. I'm pissed. Yep, I'm pissed. I hurt my car. Damn it. Mo trucker. Anyway, let's go see if we can get into some online madness with some other people. Alright folks, it looks like we're going to do a drag race. Um, not as well, but it is kind of a drag car, even though we built it for drifting. And hot rod, but that's what hot rod is doing. I think I just missed that starting line, like really bad. And everybody's going, you ain't running no drag slicks, are you? Oh, come on, bro. Don't hit me. Bro. Seriously. Okay. I'm a Camaro guy. Like, forever. But, why, dude? You just messed my Bel Air up. You know what, Pietti? We're after you. Which is, this is really wrong. Muscle on muscle hate, but oh, he hit me. Oh, oh. <laughs> okay, we're just gonna throw one fat ass drift, bald the tires. in here do some drifting oh oh how did I wow I swore I was gonna catch my fender on that all right quarter panel god damn it why do I keep calling quarter panel fenders tonight probably going he's getting all kind of sideways didn't he the leader of your party is starting a race press X to join should we join them or should we just keep drifting well uh, fine we'll join them Let's do it again. Okay guys, you obviously know by doing these drag races with this drift build we ain't gonna beat uh, the Fast and Furious Supra with 999. I mean, I have it, but I ain't racing it right now. We built the 57. Let's try and get a better time off the line. Oh, um, whoa, dude. If it wasn't one Chevy, another, huh? Okay, you guys have been making the Mustang memes. And it's kind of making me feel jealous because, you know, there's just bad drivers out there everywhere. I'm beating this Camaro. Peace, bro. Oh, yeah. He tried, though. We are top of this biatch out. Red team one. Okay, folks. I think that wraps up tonight. Um, we definitely did a nice build on this thing. It can do a lot. Definitely drift. Loving it. Oh, yeah. He's like, no. Oh, yeah, okay. <laughs> this is... Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed today's build. And I will see you guys in the next video. You guys have a great day.